are about to put out a video <laughs> called So Many Fishes. Really? Yes. I'm, I'm going to set up a video again yeah, when I've got your merch on. I'm just going to walk past this. Yeah. Oh my god, that would be perfect. <laughs> yeah, you know you know who helped produce that song for us? You remember um, LMFAO? Really? So Red Foo, he produced that song for us. That's sick. Yeah. He's like, this is going to be a hit. I'm going to produce this for you. That's sick. <laughs> yeah, that'd be cool, though. That'd be so funny. Like, just mm. have a post like that. <laughs> <laughs> it has so many fishes in the background. With all the I generally just dribbled out of my mouth. I am... Um, so many Jesses. <laughs> so many. Could you imagine that? That'd be awful with a, a whole room full of me. You, you're going to become a new meme. I'd be fighting them all. I'd be like, oh, You're going to be the new meme. So many Jesses. They're going to know what that refers to. Yeah. Literally. I hope so. What was I going to say? I just had to say, but I can't remember what it was. What was it? <sighs> no, it's gone. I can't remember. It's gone. My fault. Do you just hate that? You're just thinking about something. Yes, it's the worst. I oh, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, I can't remember. It's gone. It's gone. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Oh, wow. I'll tell you what. I'll change the How subject. How do you anyway. open breast? What the heck? What? Somebody said, "How do you open breast?" That can't be English. <laughs> that ain't English language. <laughs> right, this yeah was in my fish tank until I got <laughs> until I got. God, the smell of it. I have washed it. This is in my fish tank, yeah. And I wanted my fish to have real plants, so I took this out. And not gonna lie, I actually keep this like <laughs> on my fucking windowsill. <laughs> like, oh my gosh, that's funny. <laughs> I have fish tank plants on my windowsill. That was like, wait, like, wait, I nearly remembered it then. Ah, that's so annoying. Come on, come on, it's nearly there. What was it? Think, think, think. Oh, no, it's gone. Oh, that's gonna really piss me off. Oh, man. That's the worst. I really want to ask you all something. Like, I really, it was really important to me. Something. Ask me? It was something you were gonna ask me? Like everyone listening, oh. I was gonna ask you or something because obviously most of my people were usually from America. And it was so... No, it's gone. Fuck. If it somehow comes to your mind, message me about it later or something. I will. <laughs> oh. You look so puzzled. Uh huh? It, it's probably some. Yeah. Uh, it looks Middle Eastern of some sort, so something like that. <laughs> it was like a. Right, anyway. I can't remember it, but I'm going to ask something else anyway. When you're watching a program, yeah? So when I'm. How do you know that? I don't know. How do I know what? How do you know? <laughs> How do you know that? I don't think so. <laughs> He's probably right. Um, uh, when you're watching a program, this is asking everyone a question right here, right now. If you hear another accent, yeah? Do you, tr like, correct it and be like, that's not how you say that. So, I was watching on Netflix the other day a, um, like, a, a show on the best slow cooker, like a, a barbecue cooker. 
So I've kind of learned the different words we use. So I, I kind of used to use them both. Sometimes, like when I talk to um, my friends from the UK, I say like whereabouts, which is something Americans don't really say. We don't say whereabouts. Do not. Yeah, not really. So whereabouts is that? Yeah, we don't say things like that. Or, See, this, um, this this was the word. Sorry, before I get kebab, they said kebab. Oh yeah, we we don't say kebab over here. We do and say I was kebab. like, what the fuck is a kebab? And then I saw the food, and I was like, well, that's a kebab. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, shit. Well, it's kind of like it's kind of like when you guys say like garage sometimes instead of garage. We say garage. You guys say garage. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah
So when you say a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, you're actually saying peanut butter and jam. Yeah, we're just saying jelly because, like, the terminology to say it is that's like the proper way, supposedly, for us. That's just fucked in my head because all the time as a kid, when I heard it's peanut butter jelly time, it's peanut butter jelly time on all, all yeah. Eborn's World, which is like my favourite website as a kid, you meant jam all that yeah. time. Because I, I kept thinking to myself, why are they putting jelly? In a sandwich with peanut, that doesn't make sense. Why would you yeah. put jelly? Like jelly is no, jelly's vile. Why would you do that? And now I, I understand. Know, yeah. It's just the, it's just the, yeah, it's just the, the basically the ghetto version of it, I guess you could say. Have you had marmite? Yeah, and we sometimes call it marmalade if it's a certain kind, but we don't oh, really say like the, marmalade. The brown stuff, marmite. Yeah. The things that taste like shit. Yeah. You call that marmalade? Sometimes. Like, I think it, like, if it says it on the label, we do. But we don't, like, generally... Ah! What do you I mean? Know. I know. I don't know. Like, it's so hard to explain. What do you call marmalade, but... then? Marmalade is, like, to us, marmalade is kind of similar to jam, but it's a certain kind of jam to us. Yeah, because that is right. Marmalade is literally on the like the brother to jam. Yeah, but we yeah, but we don't really call it marmalade unless it says it on the label. Then we'll like call it that. But we won't generally say marmalade for stuff. So what do you call these specs? We call them glasses. You call them glasses. Yeah. This this we... is one that's always fucked with me. A hairband. You call uh -huh. it a. Do you call it a hair tie or something? Hair tie, or yes. Yeah, hair a tie. Hair tie and like a hair clip. You guys call it something different, which I've never understood. Can't remember what one it is. I've never yeah, understood. Yeah, usually, that. usually, usually the difference is because like when we receive products that come from the U.S. and they get sent all over the U.S., that's what they put on the label. So we kind of like go by whatever. Like even, so but even when it. Even when it comes from certain other countries, sometimes those other countries call it what we call it too. Mm. But we just kind of go by whatever the label says for the most part. I think, wow, well, I don't know how, it must have just been like, the UK must just be really fucking stubborn. Yeah. <laughs> and like, like, no, this is our way of saying it, this is how we're going to say it, and that's that. Because mm -hmm. I feel like, yeah. I, yeah, I do feel like the English, the English way of speaking is very different. Yeah, we say pavement. Yeah, we say sidewalk. Which makes more sense to me. A sidewalk yeah. makes more sense because but you pavement, walk on the side. What's, what we refer to as pavement is the actual cement that's built on it, not concrete. so much what it is. Yeah. Like the concrete. Yeah. <laughs> so what... So what would you call, like, a car park? Would you just call it, like, a parking lot? Yeah, we call it a parking lot. Or sometimes we call it a parking structure. Yeah. Or or the garage. I mean, sometimes it's a garage, like, if it's named that. Like, if you're, like, park in the garage, you know? Like, not Do even we, just at a home. We say, like, we're going to a shopping center. You would say more, yeah. Mm-hmm. What we yeah. call biscuits? They call cookies. What you call all biscuits cookies? No, not necessarily. It's it's. Because like, like it cookies just... to us are like chop chip cookies. Yeah, like, that's what we consider cookies. Yeah. And then like biscuits to us are more like your variety of biscuits. Yeah, biscuits to us is that. just yeah, biscuits is just like the kind you throw in the oven and <laughs> <laughs> let them rise. That's what we consider biscuits. So what would you call cookies? The big one? Yeah, like whatever whatever the round ones are, the oatmeal, chocolate chip. Oh, those right, ones. yeah, yeah, yeah. Should we say petrol station? Yeah, we, we say, say gas. gas station. Uh -huh. We really generalize it, you know what I mean? Like, that's the thing is I think you guys are more proper with it and we're more like kind of the dumbed down ghetto way kind of <laughs> no, because Americans are lazy about the way we talk so yeah but no I'll tell you what I'll be completely honest with you 
I have a lot of friends from London because I don't actually live that far away from London. I'm like two hours. Best only fans. Mwah. Love you. Thank you. And we, I don't actually live that far away from London. So I have like a lot of friends who come back and forth. And I'll tell you what, like the lingo in London, I. <laughs> Mate, it's like another fucking language to me. I don't understand. I don't understand anything. Yeah, that's true. Like, you guys, the UK in general just has so many different. Yeah. I'm like, that's a new fucking dictionary. You need a new dictionary. I don't. I don't yeah. understand. Like they have like. They just have their own words for everything. Like Welsh like, too. Like Welsh really trips me up. Yeah, because obviously Welsh have their own language. Like physically have their own yeah. language. Yeah. 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 I mean, when you think about it, like, United Kingdom and United States, they're kind of similar but really different. Every area you go to, obviously, you're just going to have, like, different accents and stuff, like, every part that you venture yeah. into, but the majority of it. Yeah, I, like, I don't even, exactly. what trips me out is I don't even know what's considered, and there's, like, there's, like, really no such thing as an accent. We just, we all sound different to each other. It, <laughs> like, it's just so hard to explain. And can you tell... Like, can you tell straight away? Like, can you be like, oh, they're from, they're from yeah, see, I'm really Kansas good with or it. something, or they're Yeah, from I'm South. really good with it because, like, I'm really good. Like, I've toured all over the U.S., so I'm pretty familiar with what region of the U.S. they're from. And then, like, I'm pretty good at knowing the difference between, like, let's say, for instance, somebody from Australia and somebody from New Zealand. Mm. Um, and then in the U.K., you know, like, I can tell, like, when it's when it's a little bit harsher, you know, if it's, like... You know, certain like I've actually been able to get certain parts of the UK right. Like I'll know when it's London, I'll know if it's um, you know more like uh, uh, you know uh, like I'll even like Suffolk and stuff like that. I don't know. It's like it's a mix. I kind of mm. can hear like harshness in certain words that I'll know. Yeah, we definitely all do sound different. Like if you go up north, it's like up to north. Like yeah, you guys like London. London tends to be like the most proper in terms of how they enunciate. Mm. They're very precise. Like nothing it's rolls like, over. A lot of London though, kind of goes down the route. Like won't talk like that all the time. Yeah. Got, like, a really big like London accent on there. Yeah, way more posh. <laughs> way more posh. See, that's not posh to us. Yeah, that's see, it is to us. More like that's more like that's more like I can't you know. That's like that's like a little cockney twang. Paul should be like, mm-hmm. "Oh, darling, please may I yeah. go for a walk outside? That would be lovely if we could do that this afternoon." Like that would be. <laughs> yeah. That would be like. Posh well, and see, Americans but... Americans view posh for the most part as really really proper English. They don't really like think of it in it. terms. They don't think of it in terms of location. So right. Much. To, to Americans, like, you sound posh if you're just, like, very proper in the way you enunciate it. Mm. So, like, if you finish the word off, instead of saying, like, 